use the TI-89 to find the vertex of a quadratic function. For this video and videos similar to these, visit the website www.titutor.com. Here are some prerequisite skills. First, we'll take a look at the example of a minimum graph. And in this graph, there appears to be a valley. Next, we'll take a look at the example of a maximum graph. And in, in this example, there appears to be a peak. Now we'll find the vertex of the parabola y is equal to x squared minus 6x minus 3. So we'll enter the equation into the y equals part of our calculator. And then we'll graph by simply pressing graph. I'll enter the y equals. I'm going to put in the equation x squared minus 6x minus 3. And now I'll graph. Next, we'll zoom in on the graph. So we'll use the zoom fit feature. So I'll press F2 for zoom. I want to use the zoom fit option, which is A. So I'll press enter. Now we'll calculate the vertex. So we'll enter the math option, which is F5. The graph appears to be the graph of a minimum. So we'll select number three. We'll set our upper and lower bounds. So I'll press enter. Hit X for a lower bound. I simply want to set my bullseye to the left of my vertex. I'm already to the left, so I'll press enter. For upper bound, I want to set my bullseye to the right of the vertex. I'll press enter. For a vertex of 3, negative 12. Thanks for watching.